Okay, boys and girls, the next thing we need is SKSE. You can get that at their website, which is skse.silverlock.org. And I'll put a link on the bottom if I remember or try. Now, they got the classic build version, which is for the old Skyrim original. They have the VR, which is for the virtual reality version. And they have the current SE build. That's the one you want. Click on that. And if you have 7-Zip installed for the previous video, you'll be fine over here. If not, install 7-Zip. Then do this again. Because once you click, you want to open. You want to put up this folder right here. You want to highlight everything. And you need to put it in the Skyrim system folder. Not the data folder, but the the system and that would be under program files x86 steam steam apps common skyrim special edition and there's data you don't want data you want skyrim special edition folder right there you highlight that you hit ok And install and done. You now have SKSE installed. Now, when you run the game, you want to run it from SKSE. So, we have to go here and we go to C drive because we need to make a shortcut to SKSE loader so we can use SKSE. SKSE runs Skyrim. You run SKSE, it takes care of running Skyrim. Okay, so programs x 6 Steam, Steam Apps, Common, and Special Edition, and there it is right here. SKSC underscore loaded.exe. You want to right click, drag it, and then select create shortcut here and that's what you run from now on got it that's it for this video thank you for watching